So, you just resigned with the Seahawks. Uh, I understand that you are so popular in the locker room that there would have been a revolt if you didn't resign. Uh, is, that, is that the truth? Are you I don't know. In the uh, I mean, I've got some buddies in there. I'm a bit of a jokester. I like to rag on some guys, so I think a lot of guys like that. But I don't know if there would have been a revolt. I don't know if I'd go that far. Uh, being this, this the guy, are you the, the glue guy in the locker room that keeps the, the, the offense and the defense together? I think there's a few different kind of glue guys. Uh, you know, I consider myself one of them. But I don't know. That's kind of a, a kind of group effort. I think that you know, I look at guys like Cam Chancellor's guy really kind of bridges that gap. Uh, Sherm, Russ, Doug Baldwin's another one. So I think there's a few guys that kind of take that role on. Uh, speak, uh, like a players being outspoken, the Seahawks are well known for that. But it mostly seems to be the defensive guys, the Mike Bennett. Richard Sherman's offense is a little more laid back, it seems. Yeah, I think that's kind of the nature of the position, too, though. You know, when you're a defensive player in the NFL, you've got to be just physical and kind of in your face. And, and that's your personality on and off the field most of the time. So, uh, where you know, offense is a little more, you know, rhythm, methodical. Uh, defense is violence. Yes. So, violence impact. you know, I think a lot of guys on offense who have opinions and kind of get out there and do a lot of things in the community and help out, but just kind of go about it in different ways. Now, uh, what are your thoughts on the, the reports coming out of ESPN this week about a divide in the locker room? I think uh, Doug Baldwin was talking about how it's just a product of the competitive fire that you guys have and uh, the kind of atmosphere that Pete Carroll likes to, to foster. Yeah, that's definitely part of it is, you know, it's very competitive in there. And uh, to be honest, uh, it's kind of like having, you know, brothers, you know, you fight with your siblings and you guys are fine later. Uh, we're pretty close to guys and I know there's been some article and talks about the turmoil in our locker room, but I mean, I'm in there every day and it's uh, definitely no turmoil. So it's a pretty big stretch to say the least. Things are going well, but it is very competitive.